People always ask how I balance my family life with 400 shows a year. I'm just doing what I love with the people I love. It's my magic life. The people in the hotel that are making art, we've been admiring this guy that had this surfboard and he was a spray paint artist. And uh, we picked out a pattern and got to watch him make it. Yeah. And that, was, that was pretty awesome. It was pretty cool. What did he make it from, Lana? Uh, spray paint. And? <laughs> a piece of cardboard. A piece of cardboard to do the different textured things. Like the different, I can't think of the word, but you know. Waves. To make wave. What do you call it? Spaces. Wave lines and different things. I can't think of the word. Sorry. No, it was awesome. The guy, his name was Daniel. He was great. He yeah. was awesome. He made the whole thing in like 10 minutes. I mean, he started with nothing and it was done in like 10 minutes. It's cool. Like, it's beautiful. It is beautiful. It's hanging in Lana's room right now. Tell me your name, sir. My name is Daniel. 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 This one is one picture in Costa City. Cancún, México. My name is Chico Picasso. Nah, yeah. No doubt. Wow. That is beautiful. Yes, yes, thank you. Amazing. Good job. Thank you, thank you. Now he's going to fire it, Natalie. Yeah, back up, people fire it. Yeah. Back up for this one. <laughs>
very pretty. It took him 10 minutes to make and like 48 hours to dry. So good thing we didn't get it on the very last day that we were staying there. Yeah, nobody told us that. <laughs> no. So he was like, you gotta let it dry. Don't, don't, you know, whatever. He didn't say how long it would take to dry. You were still so. I was so worried about getting it home because I didn't want something, I didn't want it broken. I didn't want it scratched. I didn't right. want it. Luckily, we got it home safe. It yep. was good. It's good. We packed it. We packed it and we put it between clothes and things. So it was soft stuff all around it. So, yep. Hey, Brady. <laughs> um, the boys, at nighttime, we put them in their little uh, car seat in their stroller. Mm -hmm. Just while we were getting ready for bed, brushing our teeth. We had the iPad on the steps, and they were like in the entryway, the foyer of the uh, apartment that we had, or the hotel room that we had, the two-story apartment we had. And um, we put the iPad on like the third step so they could just see the iPad. And they were in love with PJ Mask. Mm -hmm. PJ Mask was like the theme of the vacation for the little boys. Mm -hmm. um, Lex and Julian, uh, the I said the theme song of that Cancun trip was yeah. PJ Masks. Yes. Anytime anybody got a little upset, you just start singing PJ Masks, it's a PJ Mask, and they would stop and start smiling, and this is how they would dance with their hand, and they just had a good time. They were good troopers, because we would go out, and we'd go at nighttime, and sit around with Mr. Potato Head and his wife, as you call him. And the boys would just enjoy watching PJ Mask and sipping their non-alcoholic beverages that we got them and just hung out. It was, it was good. I wasn't sure. I mean, this was their first vacation. Dude, we took them to a bar at 11.30 at night. And they're watching people sing karaoke and they're drinking non-alcoholic drinks. And they cannot hear PJ Mask because the karaoke is so loud. But they're content and they're yeah. happy. And yeah, they're doing good. Headaches. It was the karaoke. Yeah. Yeah, it was very loud. And they weren't good, were they? No. <laughs> no. We just laughed at the at the singers. Yeah. It was pretty bad. But, there but there was a few were, that were pretty good. They did real good. It was... There's a few that were pretty good. Actually, yeah. But, but not... The, no. the majority were not good singers. But they had fun. So, I guess that's what counts, there right? There you go. But yeah, the boys put up with it, and they did real well. And yeah, I mean, at that point, they were almost two. Not quite... And it was first vacation because they were born in 2020. So no vacation after they're born and no vacation the following year because we were still making up for 2020. So this was their first vacation. And they did, they did, they went along with the flow. They just along for the ride, did real good. They did right? great. Yeah, yeah. Lana did all right too. Hey. <laughs> I think Lana had a good time. Right, honey? Yes. You wouldn't mind if we went back to Cancun this year, right? Yes. You would mind? No, I wouldn't. No, you wouldn't mind. Okay, okay. You said you wouldn't. Would you wouldn't mind? So I, I wouldn't said yes. mind. So you say no, I wouldn't mind. God, Yes, Lee. I wouldn't mind. She's arguing with you? No, you wouldn't. You No, okay. We'll talk about this later. <laughs> Alright, so uh, what else do we have here? Parasailing. Oh, Natalie yes. has been bugging me since we've gotten together. We you take me parasailing? I've yep. done it before, honey. It's it's a hundred bucks. It's too. Real. It's a hundred bucks. I did it once before, and it was fun, but I've never done it over the ocean. Was that over the ocean? Where did yeah, you do it? Over it? The ocean. I don't know. I have to ask mom and dad now. It was when I went on a trip with mom and dad, and it was she's parasailing over the woods down in North Carolina. No, I thought it was a lake, but I think maybe it was. A, it might have been. I don't know. Anyway. I had never done it with you. How's that? It had been years, and it was fun, and Mom has never done it at all, because it was me and Daddy that did it. So, she said it was on her bucket list, and I said, yes! Wes, we gotta go, too! <laughs> I wanna go, too! So, Willow and Lana watched the boys, and yeah. Natalie and I and the in-laws went parasailing. Yeah. Baby, I love you too. will you marry me? Yes. 
all over again. Yes. One day uh -huh. after we pay off this vacation. It's paid off. <laughs> Woo! I don't feel real. Why, why I feel like it's a movie. I don't know. Because oh. it's just so smooth. Yeah. This is smoother ride than the boat. Yeah. I was getting, I was getting seasick on the boat. Now you don't want to fall. We can still fall. We got a parachute. safe with a life jacket on then they strap you to all these bars and all these weights above us that's what sinks you now we're going high Snorkeling over here. Remember that guy gave us the set? The lifeguard was so cool. That's why it's white? I think so. Why is it so dark there? If that might be the reef and the sand pockets. The reef is the dark. Reef is dark. That's pools of sand. Dropping pretty quick. Let the line get slack. Bringing in the line. Oh. What are we doing? Is it letting us off at the beach? Carousel place? My feet don't dangle as low as yours. I got one foot in. My foot don't dangle as low as yours. Now I'm in. Now I'm in. <laughs> my whole butt went out. Yeah, my whole butt did too. <laughs> my left foot got dipped the first time, but you got all the way to the kneecap. Wave, wave. He's taking pictures, maybe. Alright, ready? I don't know what we're doing. Yeah. Kinda hoping that Chris and Jesse can take us back before your parents get back.
favorite part of parasailing, besides being up there, was being jet skied out and back. That was fun. The jet ski ride out to the boat and back was a lot of fun. I would just rent jet skis and play out there for an hour. That'd oh, be... but you don't, the whole thing you gave me until my parents wanted to do it, and I convinced you to do it with them, was it's so expensive. I'm it's like, stupid expensive for an so hour. jet skis. The golf cart was $80 at Island of Maharis for an hour. You only live once. You $80 might as well for a golf enjoy cart? Enjoy your vacation. They said gringos. Gringos. Come get here. One vacation a year if you're lucky. If I we're lucky, most people might get more weeks vacation than that. I don't think most people go on multiple vacations a year. I think most people go on one if they go on vacation at all. They might get vacation days from work, but they might not go anywhere. I don't know. I just right. know what we do. Anyway, I'm just saying, live it up while you got the chance. Right, honey? Didn't we learn? Life is short. Well, you almost died that summer, so exactly. yeah. Exactly. So, so enjoy it. <laughs> So, uh, how was parasailing? It was fun. How was the boat ride? It sucked. <laughs> it was so choppy. And then they, you know, they're taking the person, the people around and then they're going over the choppy water instead of going out further where it's smoother. Because they're advertising. They're trying to stay along right. the shore to, do, to brag. I, These guys are doing it. You yeah. should do it too. And I don't normally get seasick. I am not one that gets seasick, but... Oh my gosh, I was so glad when it was our turn to go up because it was smooth and it was nice and my stomach calmed down. Mm -hmm. I was like, Whew. this is good. The the ride in that oh. parasailing, you can't you can't explain how smooth it is. It's like riding a Tesla. You don't feel it. Yeah. It's that smooth. It's very smooth. You're just you're just floating. I mean, that's what you're doing, you're floating. And it's so pretty. It's so pretty to see all the different water colors and the Everything from way up high. That sounds it's beautiful. pretty, but I'll probably be like terrified. You'd be terrified? No, you wouldn't. You get it's up like, there, it'd be fine. I, she gets freaked out on a Ferris wheel, though. That's true. Maybe she'll grow out of it. I used to get freaked out on Ferris wheels, too. Yeah. But I grew, I grew out of it, so you gotta keep trying Ferris wheels. <laughs> we'll find out. This didn't seem like a conversation for anyway, me. Anyway. Well, you you were never offered to go parasailing anyway. It was just no, us adults that, that were gonna. You did. I don't know. She's old enough. Oh. You, you asked. You said you sh you should probably you should probably go. It'll oh. help face your fears or something like that. And you said. Huh. I, said, I didn't oh. think we were even talking about letting you try because it's so expensive that it was just gonna. No, be that was. But it's my little girl. No, I'd spend right? money on her. Oh, jeez. <laughs> what about me? Well, I love you, baby. <laughs> I love you. You more read it. Okay, next time I want something on vacation, you're asking your dad for it. I'm not going to ask. I'm going to say, hey, dad, dad, can we do this? Who got you a cell phone? <laughs> it's true. Who got you a cell phone? <laughs> it's true. Who got it It spoils for you? you rotten. Who got you a cell phone? That's it. Anything, it. I, anything I want, I'm, I'm getting it to go through her. Anyway, <laughs> we so had an worst. amazing time in yeah. Cancun. Uh, what are we doing this year, honey? I don't know. I've seen people have gone to Aruba and it looks really pretty. What is even I just thought it would change it up and you still get to use your passport. We have to use our passports. I'm making us use our passports. We got all the kids' passports last year. And we had to renew hers and get the boys new is ones. There, is there water? I want to use it. Is there water in Italy? Yeah. Yes. If you want to go to Wait. Venice? When we go to Venice, there's water everywhere. I know, but can you get in it? Where are we talking? I don't know. I'm sure there's a beach somewhere. It's a big old boot. They gotta have beaches around the end of the boot. How big is Italy? We might be going to Europe. You think so? It's a European vacation. Hopefully it goes better than the movie, but oh. <laughs> that would be awesome. I'm very confused. What, why I don't know. There? We'll have to see. Anyway, uh, only one more thing left to say. Ready? Ready? It's a long flight Ready? for the boys, though. So see you next week. Ready? See, see you next week! week.